that a half halt has um, one principle um, that is we have to drive in to the half halt and we use by driving we achieve more contact with the hand and then we use this more contact to get the horse a little bit back and then we drive out so a half halt is always in back out that is the principle of it but now we come to different forms of half halts it is like with these degrees of uh, the basics there is not one truth a half halt with a well trained horse is different from a half halt with a first level horse it depends on the footing on the weather on the situation you are in and whether you do the half halt on a circle or on the straight line uh, it depends on whatever and that is the reason that you get so many answers about the half halt every if you ask 10 riders you get 12 answers how they do the half halt the half halt depends on the personal uh, degree of, of, of strength, of, of feel, and, and on the horse and on everything. But the principle is always there. And the best and the latest form of a half halt is to give a half halt as a moment of more contact. And that is it. You know, in the beginning, when you have a green horse and you want to come from trot to walk and back to the trot, that's quite an effort. That is already a half halt. Yeah, you you have to 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 pull already a little bit back in order to achieve it. But later, when the well-trained horse, then you simply sit up and give a half halt. Let's start with Chris and let's start with canter and let's start with extended canter around the arena that the horse comes in the mood to work and then we demonstrate. We go for that and we demonstrate later some half halts. So now he does a halt after the extension, but he does it smart. He canters down, upper body maybe in the beginning a little bit in front, then the normal seat, and now the deep seat and the halt. So, and he does that now three times. Do that three times. Oh, fine. Oh. And now on the next long side, extension, and now a half halt just to the collection. That's, that means now he rides now this half halt with his body. You will see you when you are in the collection immediately überstreichen. Go down. So oh, now sit up, überstreichen. Reins are hanging. You see this horse listens to the body. Why? He had, he had trained the horse in the right way. He has extended and then sit down, halt. The horse interprets the, the rider in a way, deep seat means halt. So the moment you give the horse now with your seat more contact, the horse comes back, is collected, and that is a half halt. That is the last the most sophisticated version of a half halt. The moment of more contact and the horse comes up. What has he done? He had trained the horse in the right way and found a way that the horse listens to his body. He speaks with his horse body language, changes of, of body. He is no longer in the situation that he has to pull the horse back to ride a half halt. He sits up. Oh.